Colleen ISD hosting a special Freedom Walk today, honoring the men and women killed 18 years ago today. Fox 44's Noelle Mendoza, she's live in the control room tonight with more on the ceremony honoring those fallen heroes. Hey, Noelle. Hey. Well, hundreds walked alongside our first responders here in Central Texas this morning, demonstrating our strength, not only as Americans, but as people from all walks of life, united as one. A walk to remember September 11th, 2001. We have to remember that on 9-11, some horrible, horrific things happened to our nation. And it wasn't about just one group of people. It was about all people. Our society was attacked. Today, hundreds not only walked alongside our local heroes. Thank you. They thanked them for their service. Coming out here today, 18 years later, reaffirming that we will not forget. We made a pledge 18 years ago. We won't forget what, what our men and women died for. We won't forget. We'll never forget. Also marching for freedom, 11 Gold Star families who lost loved ones in the line of duty. To show my child, there are not only her father who was a hero, the, um, the public servants of 9-11, she hasn't experienced that, but we did. And um, passing it on to our now generation and letting them see our history. Knowing where we came from and how we got to where we are today is very important. Ashley Hudgens' husband was killed in Iraq. She says 9-11 brought along life lessons. It teaches us to be cautious, to be careful, and how our nation has changed. Honoring America's history and all who were affected. You can forgive people. Don't forget what happened. Now this was the 14th year Colleen ISD has hosted a Freedom Walk. September 11, 2001 was the deadliest terroristic attack on American soil in U.S. history. Live in the control room, Noelle Mendoza, Fox 44 News.